No, this is king shit, Patrick. Kato counted us in uh, via sending the count uh, via text over Discord because they're not on this call. Except the thing is, we're going to need them on this call in a second anyway. And they wrote it, uh, but they wrote it as five, four, three, 43, two, two one. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, sorry. Too busy playing a Marvel Snap in one hand to, to, to do a proper count in. They're, they're doing their best, and so are we. We are back. Uh, we are we are streaming Stories Untold today, Patrick, a game that uh, you you have been in my ear about since we saw uh, Silent Hill Townfall during the Silent mm. Hill transmission, uh, and you were you were very stoked at the idea of like we would see them tackle Silent Hill uh, because you're a huge fan of this game, and so we decided given given the season we would we would get spooky. And play some stories untold. Yes, I, I actually think both of their games are are quite good. Observation is the game that they did uh, a couple years back, and and but stories untold will put them on on the map for me. Um, and I think this is the better of their two works, but these are both excellent games. Uh, and this one in particular has some really fun VHS vibes. Uh, that they they just absolutely nail and it, like everything about the atmosphere here suggests to me they could potentially do something really cool with uh, Silent Hill. I know you you mentioned you've played a, a little bit of this. Is that is that what I what you I recall? Yeah, um, I think I think I did the house abandon uh, a couple years ago. This was when I was moving into uh, our new place and I was looking for stuff I could play on my laptop. And I briefly thought I could play this on my laptop, um, which mm -hmm. I sort of could, right? Because it's like. They're really lovingly animated, but largely static screens. But even then, like there's enough happening on the three, like the three D, uh, you know, on the video card, that playing on a laptop was not really a, a going concern. Especially with the like the second I hit episode two, I was like, this is not playable, uh, or at least it's not very hmm. pretty. Uh, so, so I sort of bailed. But, but here's the other thing: is I understand it, this studio didn't necessarily make all these like chapters, these games, right? These are these are like remakes or adaptations of like I mean, in House of Bandon, like a Twine game. That might be true. I don't. I don't. I don't actually know um, the. You, you could be. You could be correct on the origin story of uh, some of the the stories here. I, I actually don't. I can look that up for myself. I can look that up while we're while we're playing. But uh, yeah, it's just. It's just. It, it's kind of funny because this game. You would look at the screenshots and consider it like pretty low fidelity. Which it is and it isn't. It's like it re it renders really well a bunch of very specific scenes, um, but it is not a game where you're like exploring a big uh, 3D environment. Oh, House Abandon was a solo release. Interesting. So only the first one was its own thing, then Stories Untold becomes sort of oh, packaging okay. of a collection of of stories. And look, I'm I love. I don't know. Well, I do know what happened. These are they're hard to sell. Rob, I love anthologies. Like that's why I also yes. love short stories. And anthology is the sh the short story of of the cinematic format. It's not something we see in video games ever. It is extremely rare to see one off or or, or collections of stories. Uh, I cannot recommend highly enough. I've only seen the first one, but I've heard the rest are excellent as well. But Guillermo del Toro produced a an anthology on Netflix. Um, called the Cabinets of Curiosities, which are like 40, 45 just minutes came high out, right? quality. Yeah, they're dropping them two episodes at a time throughout this week in the lead up to Halloween, and it got me in the anthology move. It's it's just it is just like because there, there's something about the horror format spe specifically. Well, not because <laughs> like horror like stories tend to unravel the longer you pull at the tension of them. Yes, and the anthology format allows you to execute really quickly on a smart idea and also are there characters here who cares 45 minutes is just long enough for you to enjoy a premise and not get tired of it uh so yeah let's let's dig in uh to to this a little bit um and i i already in sorts help man they were like like Super dialed in on um, this is this is peak Stranger Things, isn't it? When well, they're yeah, let's when, see. When so Untold this. Stories is probably twenty six, so it's twenty seventeen. Stranger Things season one is 
2016. So yeah, this is, and then Stranger Things season two is pretty quickly. Uh, Stranger Things season two is October 27th, 2017. Uh, this comes out okay, February 27th, 2017. So it comes sandwiched in between the first two seasons of Stranger Things. So I, yeah, there's, look, th- th- uh, uh, these kinds of keyboards, like, these frequencies were already the vibe. Stranger Things just brought back a thing that just popularized the thing I already enjoyed. Yeah. Uh, all right, let's let's fire up the House of Ben and see what's going on here. All right. Uh, shout out to Sergeant Sphinx in the chat, who is also a wonderful contributor, uh, follower, and donator to to Save Point last week. I don't think there was someone who gave more than Sergeant Sphinx did uh, over the over the course of those days. Oh hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I hope it's not too hot for people. Oh, I hope it is too hot. Shadow, don't never turn it down. Hell yeah. I need to have a sick synth playlist that just accompanies me 24 <laughs> 7. I would love to just, I just walk around my headphones and just yeah. I oh, you mean like the like player? Yes, that t- like some yeah somebody with like it's strapped but around you know their neck. Meme, yeah, you know that meme where like someone's like sh- like doing a trumpet to someone behind them. Like I want that, but a s- yeah. synth is being blasted in my ears at all time. There's a is there a lo-fi synth to bop to? We were literally just on the podcast that you'll hear tomorrow talking about sounds similar to this. With a modem connecting to a... BBSs were before me, but... Not far off. Yeah, that's right. So th- I thought I remember this being a text adventure. Uh... Oh, shit. Uh, Noel, we're hoping to get some Signalis talk on the pod. There's actually an extensive Signalis uh, section, thanks to, to Ren playing the game. <laughs> so I guess right now we're trying to figure out what, like, verbs we have. <laughs> Why? Why are mortgages seven <laughs> percent? Uh, all right. So let's see. Uh, can you look at the yard? Mm. Hell yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, we had a key. I didn't even know we. Okay. Well, yeah, it was that's easy enough. Box. I wanted to. I wanted to go in the back, but that's fine. Door clicks open. Let's go inside. Well, we can still go back. We should recon the area. Yeah. Oh well, never mind. Okay, I bet I bet this is, we're gonna have to still go around back. Yep. Damn. God, the uh, sound effects on these key presses is tremendous too. Well, we have a nice combination of your actual keyboard, and then <laughs> I don't know where your keyboard ends and the game keyboard begins. Like the room temperature room from the community. Uh, hi, son. Hope you enjoy your break. <laughs> but then you remember, you don't have a father. <gasps> uh, <laughs> found something in the attic for you. Oh, yeah, nothing ominous about that. The house is grand.
Oh my god. Uh... Yeah, well, I, I, Rob, I didn't anticipate this was also going to expose our typing deficiencies. <laughs> Rob is typing. No, that's twice now. Okay. I don't want to go exit house. I think you want to go down I say, say go to go, say go to backyard. Say go to backyard. Try actually like describe the house one more fucking time for me. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Bob's already turned on this game. The puzzle master is being bested. What would his well maintained be? Uh, I thought I mowed my lawn. Lots for the of last lots time of rocks and succulents uh, were sort of put mm -hmm, in. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. Good memories. So is this like this isn't the primary house? This is a secondary house. Have memories. <laughs> Fla cue flashback. Yeah. Yep. Uh. What are we, um, yeah, what are we looking for? There was a the generator shed? back here? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, look, look, maybe look, look around. go to let's generator. Let's start look around. Yeah, that's probably. Mm hmm. Uh, Vinny Bush's, uh, points out, have we typed help to see the available commands? It might, yeah, we might actually get, uh, prompts. Nope. No. <laughs> no. 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 Nope. Uh, all right. So go, I guess go to generator. Oh, use. Yeah, we can use it too. Is there a back door? I forgot. Generator. Back wall. Kind of weird. There's not a. See, that's how every time it, I typed that, it was just enter the house. Break the break the front door down so that Rob never has to enter it again. <laughs> light this light this note on fire from my father. I've never I've never lived in a house uh, that relied on a generator like that. Now, granted, it's not it, a good the sign. course of COVID. Over the course of COVID, did I wonder, do I need to buy a generator? Do I need to pull a, a full Vinnie Caravella and have a backup? Thought about it. Yeah, there's a few places that, like, if we move, I might want to get uh, Jenny just as a backup. It seems um, like one of those things, if I suddenly saw it on sale. Okay, I'll just have that and I'll shove it in the garage. Okay, the hall is brightly lit. Down. There's access to the kitchen and living room here, as well as a set of stairs. Let's go get some food. I'm I hungry. The Sonos offer generator. Mm. No, but I did get recently get an email from my uh, my extensive collection of lawyers that said they've come to a settlement with Snap uh, for thirty five million dollars uh, for the residents of Illinois, of which I I rank among them. I don't know what kind of payout that will be, but the Snapchat one was a settlement for both of for me and my children. <laughs> There's a payout for me and both my daughters. <laughs> Those filters violated my children's privacy, Rob. Right, so the kitchen has no utility snacks? room. The narrator is not interested in the snacks. Oh, well, all right. All right, what sort of, old Rocky top. sort of setup we got here? College fund, go. No, all the money I get from my 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 leg completely legitimate settlements go to buying new Sono speakers. That's where that goes. They already have college funds. They already they already get several hundred dollars a month from me for those. Ooh, can we see? We can't oh. There's no stack of board games to look at. Not no, it didn't take any note of it. Mm. So we're just we're just going upstairs, huh? Yeah. Rob, I don't know why there's such so, so much ominous music. All I hear are happy vibes. Oh, no, 
Happy Sorry, times. this is an ominous music. Happy this is memories. Just, this is, uh, like, it is more, uh, like, contemplative ambient is the way I would describe it. There's a bit of angst to okay. it, for sure. But, you know... Well, because even in good memories, family, you know, yeah. you're, you're, su yes. you're, suppre you're suppressing things that happened off to the side during all of that. You know, you may have a good memory, but come on, they're more complicated. And also, your family ain't here anymore. For There's something like, you know, time, time yeah. has moved on. Why aren't your parents here? <laughs> Everything seems cool here. <laughs> Use toilet. Use toilet. Trying to teach your kid this command, right? Oh my god. Fine. We're not. We, we don't have a lot of interactable objects. Hang on. So hang far. on. Hang on. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta take a flyer on like bathrooms have these. <laughs> Toaster beef searching for contemplative ambient on Spotify yields the Space Dreams playlist. Dude, this is why I had to leave Spotify. The curation fucking sucks. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Wow, fuck your sister, huh? Just don't care about that room. I need mine to Well, it's... Th there's, there's the thing that I'm here for. So many good memories, and it's been preserved so well. All right, Rob, now the amount... It's been a so long many time good since memories. I've, this, so I've, so I've, I've I've basically forgotten everything that happens, but I don't like the fact that the most common word that has been uttered here is good. 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 Hang on. We play some games? Some games. Hang on. Patrick, are you, are you picking up on this? Standard. We're playing this through it. We're playing this through a wood grain TV. Oh shit! What does that tape say on the on, on the deck? Uh, it's not tape. It's a little clock. Tape, oh, tape uh, loader. Says, tape loader. That's what it says. Tape loader. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, turn on TV. Can we turn the TV on? Hey, yeah, there's the box, though. You want to open the box? Yeah, look, I've I've seen Hellraiser before. <laughs> well, I love opening the box. What could what could it be? Oh! Aha. A future of 128K plus like, 2. Like our keyboard says. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Socrates friend Daryl asks, Rob, if you could have the bezel of your nice OLED TV be wood grained, would you? No. Uh it's not like that is I feel like I have enough uh like the, the carver speakers have a beautiful wood grain. I like the ah, console. So you I get the aesthetic the from from the speakers. Yeah. I see. Yeah, no, see. our our house like the, the whole entertainment area is it's plenty warm. A copy of the House of Bandit, which we are playing right oh, now. Oh, interesting. Oh, that's weird. Love to play in an adaptation of my life. So I feel like we got to go to the sister's room before we... Well, yeah, we got to check it, because it feels, like, yeah, it feels yeah. like something's about to happen. That's going to start whatever meta experience is about to occur. Your sister. So 128k. Is that the um? Is that the computer speed? The is that the, the the memories? Oh, okay. I can't remember how much was in my original 48666. Uh, it would be standard more. at that point. Yeah. 640 was standard. Uh, at, like in DOS, before they started adding additional memory via other means, uh, which is why there's a generation of games that were hard, so hard to play, because conventional memory stopped being what they were loading games out of. Um. Because well, this is also pre DOS, right? Right. So that's like, the thing. Like, like we a... are, we are. This is like 15 years before you and I were playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So. Perfect condition. Good condition. Good memories. Can we look at? Uh, yeah, look at the posters.
Hoplin, 42, this is mid-80s. Well, yeah, but Rob and I were... I was born in 85. What are you? 80... 83. 83, right, so yeah. roughly the same time. Yeah, if they, I don't think... So, okay, it's, it's, it's more recent than that, but I didn't start... I never, I never loaded... To me, games don't load off cassettes. And nothing loads off cassettes. That never I start. I start, I start with floppy disks, right? Like, I start yeah. with... Um, although not even... The, like the the thin floppy disk. What, what was the size, the dimension of those? I forget the. I started with the three point uh, fives. Like that's that's when I was playing. Um, games. Yeah. Five point two five. Yeah, I used those at school. Like I remember that was my first my first computer I ever encountered was at school, and then we got a four eighty six uh, at home, and I had three point five floppies. Did we look at the posters? You can't just tell. What? Okay, so that's there's a pile of identical photos uh, at the bottom of the uh, of the wardrobe. There's nothing else in it. <laughs> we already examined the posters. It's just uh, like musicians and, and sports mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at art. Um, that's right. She made some. Yeah, she was good. Oh, uh, same thing, same prompt. All right, we can leave. Unless there's something... All right. Unless there's... Is there anything else here that we might have missed? Uh, no. Oh, do we go in the wardrobe? That's where we found the photos of the forest road. Oh, uh, okay, sorry, I missed that part. All right, let's go set up our computer. When I was in elementary school, we had Oregon Trail on the computer in the classroom. I think this was fifth grade, but it was not a, it was not rewritable. And so when, when you died in Oregon Trail, you were able to put your name on a gravestone. And one of the kids in the class who was always just causing shit, uh, wrote fuck on one of the gravestones, and then Oregon Trail was not allowed in the class anymore. Got taken away wow. from Wow. It was bullshit. Fantastic. It's bullshit. I, and I, I don't even know if it was... Could, could that have been rewritten? I have no idea, but that's what the teacher told us. Okay. <laughs> the thing... Okay. There we go. Fuck. Just... I, um, That got me. <laughs> oh, fuck this. Yeah. No. This rules. No. Let's go. Get out. Does that say get out? Yep, get out. Clearly neglected. You can't stand to be near the place. Yeah, these good vibes? Bullshit. Read the note. Read the note. Read the note. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Drive the car away. Can you just can we just leave? Uh, Victoria asks, can you honk? Mm. Alright. Oh my god! 
Jesus Christ. This, uh, Rob, this is, what I, this is what I say every Monday morning when I have to get my kids ready to go to school. <laughs> there is no love here. That description is really good. Through the debris. Mm. Can we turn on the generator? Just, just, just bypass this whole thing. Mamma mia, that's good. <laughs> no arp. Can we check the Zello estimate on this house? Yeah, I think things might have changed for this family home. A great opportunity awaits a motivated. I buyer. think you just exactly. You, you, uh, have you ever looked into a room and wondered not what it is, but what it could be? Uh, are there happy memories here? No, there is no love here. But you, the next buyer of this house, you could bring the love. You could bring the happy memories. And also there's a lot of mold. Was that you, was that the game? <laughs> That's the game, bro. <laughs> it's like it's a giant it sounds door very present, doesn't Rob it? <laughs> it's a giant door shutting in Rob's house. The mix is very good. This shit sounds like it's in, in the room. With me, yeah, not good. in this room. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> Helka Robot. Good bones! They are buried in the backyard! Well, what would the walls are falling apart? What? <laughs> Go upstairs. Oh man, reading the note. Rob, some bad things happen in this house. Get a get a, get a sandwich. The stop alarm. Can you stop the alarm? Yeah, you gotta stop that alarm. So now, oh, are these now verbs? Yeah. I'm not just being purposely obtuse. Like, it has been six years since I played this. So, or five years. Like, can we interact with the, the light and the... I guess we're flicking on the light. We're flicking on that light. Can we pick up the phone? Try and pick up the phone. Is it, wait, where's the phone? Well, I mean, the phone's here in front of us. But, I mean, can we use that phone? Hey, Patrick. We just turned off that alarm. Oh, that's right. There's a carcass in the kitchen. Oh. Is that Dad? <laughs> Beyond recognition. Mm. Oh, look at the writing on the wall. God damn it, fuck. He's crying! <laughs> okay. They're wet? My shoes are wet? Why are they wet? Can you take off your shoes? You want to take your shoes off? Yeah, get them off, bro. <laughs> oh, fine, fair enough. Oh, Rob, uh, is that has that always been there next to the light? What? Oh, nope, that's new. Uh, and also, the eyes weren't blacked out on the on the photos before. But oh, can you write "look for good memories"? <laughs> uh... <laughs> uh... 
Uh, we gotta exit, yeah. Man! Alright, so upstairs, I guess. What could, go, what could go wrong up there? Yeah, we get it. There's someone in the house. We don't like it. Is that someone the carcass? See. Is that is that someone some sort of presence that is living inside this note that is now bleeding? Uh oh. Yes, it would have been too much trouble to copyright this, to, co to proofread this. Neither can he. Pick up the what? Phone. Pick up the phone. Hang that shit up, Rob. I don't like the way that this person speaks of their sister. Sister. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Sisters. Huh? Uh huh. Okay. Rob, did we kill our family? Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> Number one Hedrick. thing all family killers say. No. I I mean, maybe. I mean, it's pretty gnarly in here. Yeah, if everything else has been gross, imagine this. Yeah, what else is new? This sink is a haven for all kinds of bugs. Yeah, but yeah, yes, yes, yes. Oh, okay. They have lovingly recreated. The feeling of having to reread the same shit in the text parser game a million times. Yeah, now. don't open, Rob, don't open the room to this room. We already talked to ourselves, go to sister room. Just keep avoiding this inevitable conclusion. Jennifer. That's the verb. Fuck. Break down Jennifer's door. <laughs> mm. Fuck, we gotta go in this room. What was the code? 1986. 1986. 1986. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, now we can open it. Hmm. Un open it. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. Oh, don't no. like it. Go inside. Run away? What, oh, who am I saying this to? Because we're the person behind right now. Look at note. Oh, give note. Give note. Give. <laughs> um. <laughs> I 
Kill. Hmm. <laughs> kiss. Kiss. <laughs> um. Okay. Well, what are our okay? So look, look. Let's look around again. See me sitting there, helpless. You edge closer. Move closer. Yeah, let's try looking at the note. That was my that was my thought earlier. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. Okay, maybe oh, you no. killed your sister and family. Yeah, maybe we killed everyone. It's my fault. good really good wild wild yeah. good shit good shit yeah it's just yeah i remember being so impressed with the uh i mean i think the first one might be the best one in the whole collection the other ones the other ones are, are, are good and enjoyable but there was something about where the presentation it takes an old form right one that on its face if you were to hand a text adventure over to you know, someone who had never experienced one before, not only would it be hard to parse, but also just the interface, like just aesthetically, it's sort of you're used to something different. And just that packaging recontextualizes that in a way that is just delightful. Like it's, it, it suddenly turns it into something else, even though it's, mm. you know, it is still using that old form. And frankly, like I wish it had more. We, I mean, we, ra we ran into a lot of obstacles with the text. Um, it really is pretty linear on what it wants you to do. Yeah doesn't doesn't have a lot of deviations that you can that you can go down but it's stuff like that, that. Like, we, didn't, we didn't get inside that utility closet there's got to be a way to get inside that utility closet right is there something inside the utility closet chat we never got in it it was locked it was yeah people yeah. uh all right let's 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 check out the next one yeah And again, playing this, it's not easy. It's very easy to then get excited about them making a Silent Hill game. Um, like some, this is a studio that understands aesthetics and how aesthetics mingle with interaction uh, in a way that like, I don't know what their mode is going to be in Silent Hill. Like the this game is a text parser broadly, and then observation is a you're like moving about first person right in a, in a 3d world though so it's, it's a little more complicated a uh, spinning mind it's great how the parser is non-standard so it's frustrating even for people who play text adventures which maybe might have might have been intentional 1986, new session entry we might want to turn on subtitles for this one. I think this one has a lot more voice. Dr. Williams, and in the lab itself, our volunteer, Mr. Asian. 
I'll do that after this. Artifact 23 yeah. chamber recovered from crash site B. At the moment, it appears inert, showing no signs of activity. This one is also incredible. For each stage, will come through to your terminal, and we need you to follow them exactly. Now, some of this may be unfamiliar, so always reference the manual on your terminal for guides on calibration and procedure. Once you've calibrated equipment to match our brief, the green light will flash, allowing you to. Rob, do you love to follow rules? Do you want to make? Do you want to no. make sure you do a good job? Non-essential to the current experiment is switched off. You cannot proceed until your calibration matches ours. When you're ready, let's bring this back. Oh, there we go. Ding. Look at that! Just right, like immediately, the game is like, we know what you want. You want subtitles. <laughs> Uh, we got we got another coffee mug. We got floppies. This is great because now you're just using keyboard shortcuts. Oh, look at this! We got options. Subject J one nine eight six. That is the camera, right? Uh, I think so. And I mean, you know, at this stage is you just like fiddling with things to see what turns on and what you can interact with. That's satisfying. Woo! God damn, that felt good. Yes. There's a lot of that in this in this one. A uh, 80s kid busy box. I, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I wonder what the subject is. He says with delight and interest, and also doesn't remember what it is. It's got to it's got to be them aliens, right? I mean, that's yeah. That, yeah I mean, <laughs> I'm pretty yeah. sure it was aliens. <laughs> Gotta be them aliens. But why is there a drill, Rob? Can you move that? Can you turn that drill on? Not yet. All right, looks like I can just. Uh, so I guess we're looking at the experiment just hit one, it. right? Okay. Yeah, X ray just... the artifact to determine its internal. I'm going to hit big green button. Hit it. Okay, good work. The X-ray is coming through now. What's that? No visible damage to the surrounding organic. Uh, it's material. the start of look who's talking. No signs of activity either. Oh, uh, people are saying toggle the TV's right. other image modes. I think you might can do okay. that in real time. Let's begin. Hang on. Oh, see, yeah, fucked go. up. Fuck. Yeah, what's uh, that? That's a heart? That looks like a heart. Okay, Rob, so now I'm wondering, the house that we were just in had, had no love. Do you know what brings love? Hearts. So I think this is an experiment. So true. To bring love into that house through mad scientist experiments. Uh, that's just reasonable. All right, demonstrate the effects of laser. So two. We're hitting it with a uh, uh, a long wavelength laser, right? I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a picture of this. Try using the low powered. Yep. So we're gonna turn the light generous. Um, so low powered. Oh, sorry, you're good. See here, uh, is this the where? 
is the actual like laser apparatus though. These are different wave types, but they don't. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. What was it? Six fifty. So, well, they said the lowest, right? Yeah, so six fifty. The lowest is four hundred. Uh, no, 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 no. Low powered. So we're, this is oh, this red. is oh, red. this is this red, is wavelength. Red. So yeah, so well, no, yeah, I, I didn't like, see the red part. I didn't see the red part. Yeah. Oh, wait, uh, is that is that how wavelength is that is it is it yeah is higher higher where, frequency higher it. frequency I means see, I, like I more see. power. Gotcha. I hope MK is not watching any of this. That We're going to be cool about this, right? Yeah, just hit the green button. No reaction from first stage. Oh, no. We're just fucking with it. We're just fucking with it till you know, something happens. Rob, Rob, much, you know, again, if what we're trying to find is love... Love opens in mysterious ways, and sometimes that mysterious way is a higher frequency of laser. Oh my god! That will open the door zap to love. The shit out of it. It was two. It's five ten. Okay. Sure. I love that the the um the chair wheels around. That's like just a really fun detail. All right, hit him with love, Rob. Hit the green button. The love button. Okay, we have a reaction of some sort here, a weak signal. Mm. Let's keep going. Increase again. Maybe we shouldn't. Yeah, but don't you want to complete the experiment? Rob, this is what's happening in Severance. Hit it with a laser. Fire away. Third time's the charm. Oh. Ooh, yeah. It's alive! Love is alive! Rhythm is stable. There's no activity registering in the core. It's possibly damaged. It's Much like the. Yes, yeah, it's a broken heart. You're right, Patrick. Just like the character in the last story. This is this is just like us. Uh, you know, we got in a fight. I gotta go get some flowers. You know, maybe make dinner. And now by making dinner, I mean I'm gonna hit you with a laser frequency of 450 <laughs> nanometers. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Keep going. No. All I right. think this is actually uh, what happened. I think maybe this is what's going on in Kingdom Hearts. They're just trying to examine the Heartless. Oh yeah, hit the gain. Where's the where's the amplifier gain? Gain control. Uh. uh. Crow TRM is Mickey the one performing the experiment. God, that'd be so good. I want to live in a world where this is actually a Kingdom Hearts horror story. Do we need to abolish copyright laws so that we can do things like that? Uh, there we go. What are you trying to do right now? I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see where the gain setting is, and I don't see a, a like. I'm. I'm not seeing where the gain control is on this shit. Are, are there manuals? There, there were options. There were options back at your computer. I wonder if there's any instructions there. Oh, this is okay. just. Okay. Okay, it's just a weird, <laughs> inexact little display. Okay.
I think it's just up and down. Right, but I'm trying to find one. Is everything else already set? I think so. Uh, it was maybe maybe try turning turning other things off. Like you have other you have like the laser on. You have the oh, camera yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Nope, didn't want to do that. Sorry, little friend. What did you just do to that? I charged up the x-ray. Oh. Turn that okay, off. so that's off. Um, so is the camera supposed to be on? Oh, there we go. Um, is the wave correct? Like the one that you have, you have picked in the middle next to the 250 hertz? That is a sine wave, right? Don't ask me. I can look. <laughs> it's probably in the manual. That's a sign, and mm -hmm. so like on this, then like two point five. What did it say to set? What? So it must be the first tick there, right? Yeah, we've been over that. Well, let's let's try it one more time. Let's see if we two hundred fifty hertz. Yeah, Rob, you're all the way at the end. Yeah, there we go. Try. Yeah, I think it, I think that's right. Oh, this is infuriating. Uh, turn the camera back on. Because uh, technically we're probably supposed to keep watching that, right? Oh, okay. Aha, there, there we go. go. Now we're there. Okay. So, yeah. All right, let's fuck with this thing some more. Yeah! Not much we'll just play a louder noise. Uh, update. <laughs> or, a more or a more intensive one. <laughs> Experiment complete! Give me a treat! Uh, 500. Did it still say it was a sine wave? Here we go. Oh shit. Hit the sink, master. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, I bet we are. Wait. Rob, I get the sense that we, um. What do you mean, running out of time? It's hey, not Patrick, even our lunch break yet. This is flickering now. This was a dark window at the start. Yeah, I don't... I That yeah. seems bad. Um, but maybe that's just... Uh, we're turning the light Square on to the wave. heart that... The love that that heart is about to open itself open to. Oh. Hit it! We are opening a seeing dark dimension. On this side, seeing definite spikes in movement. But like I spikes in movement in what? <laughs> what is? You're telling me about a graph in which I don't know what we're measuring. Mm. Right, one kilohertz. This experiment's five. called agitation. Uh, when in doubt, Rob, just turn it up. Just keep turning the knob. If we did this to a normal heart, would it be cool? What would happen in my heart if I had a thousand hertz sine wave pointed at it? Am I fine? How do waves work? It depends on...
It's dance? Oh no, that's not good at all. It fucking exploded, bro! Can you hear it? You've made excellent progress. You're doing great. Now we need you to stay calm and try to relax as we go through these next steps. Look, I when people tell me to stay calm alleviate. after something disconcerting has happened, I just choose to stay calm. One of Stibbins, Robin Patrick, do the Milgram experiment. Man, one of the <laughs> most disappointing things of my life was hearing that uh, there's credible reasons to debunk that whole experiment. Mm hmm. Wasn't it like some of it was made up? Well, the whole thing was made up, but the idea was because that's the that's the thing where it proves that like most people will just be like, "Yep, I'll torture a human under orders from authority." Uh huh. Uh, but it was done by like having an actor pretend to be tortured, and apparently right. like. A lot of participants later were like, yeah, that guy wasn't being tortured, and they were giving me 50 bucks. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's, uh... It's like, a, it's a it's a famous experiment that re produces a pretty provocative piece of work, but as I, I, I gather that it is not actually that credible a study. Um, not telling us much about the human condition, but you know what is? Shooting these sine waves into this, <laughs> this xenomorph's heart. Protective casing is off. Proceed to drill the surface. God, drill it. Drill, baby, drill. Drill, baby, drill. Is she going to lose that seat? I don't know what's the polling in Alaska right now. Oh, I have no idea. There's been like more movement toward the Republicans in the last like week. That's well, kind of that's no, yeah. Everyone, everyone, get ready. The midterm is going to go poor for the Democrats. That's regardless yeah. of how you feel about the Democrats. I'm sorry, that's just what happens in the midterms. <laughs> it's more about just bleeding losses than it is getting wins. <laughs> last Galaxian, is this how the McRib was invented? <laughs> Oh, you turn the camera off. On. You just got it to blink a second ago. Yeah, put the sure. camera. Yeah, you, you just you just had it. Put that camera back on. There we go. There you go. That was all they're coming off, but drill. Oh, oh yeah. no! No 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 no! Seems fine. All the. Nope. Oh my god. Yeah, just touch that. Open that thing. Stay calm. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> God. I know how difficult this must be, but you can do this. I'm, well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how far your empathy goes. It's time to remember. Orb. Uh, Rob, people say you can click so we can get these the seizure to stop. <laughs> stop pondering. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Did that orb go into our brains? Yeah, where's where's orb? Wait, or what? <laughs> Friend. We are o orb. <laughs> Me? <laughs> this diagram. That you can understand. That you can believe. 
way out. This diagram, orb to brain. Orb to brain. I'm pretty sure this is what Elon is, is promising us with that, that brain stuff he's working on. Uh, click it, maybe? This is way too much pondering. Oh no! <laughs> yes, we're back to oh, the text adventure. Oh no! We tortured ourselves. Remarkable. You can navigate its memories. Use the computer. Work your way through. <laughs> Contact Will Smith. Ooh. Hi, ship. Somebody did point out the orb appears to have a USB C jack at the bottom of it, right below the, the eye line. Well, look, the orb is not, it, much like Apple, must conform to the regulations passing through the European Union. Everyone needs to have USB uh, C support by the end of 2024. The orb, the orb is not exempt for red the regulations. The uh, the orb has detected a crash and has notified uh, rescue crews. <laughs> Do you see that that stuff was getting set off on roller coasters? Makes sense. The minute I heard it was like accelerometer based. Yeah. Continue. yeah. We're just seeing the sad end to this alien crew's life. Yeah. Side smoke billows, exterior lights, look out, wreckage. Look at wreckage. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dr. Karate, the orb will both send data and power. Ah, uh, so that's what we got from the aliens. Not the ability to live forever, but, but the USB C standard. We can flip this USB thing. Both ways. Finally, aliens bringing us peace on Earth. I think we just leave now. No. Okay. Uh, try, try, just leave because that that seems to have worked for us before. Yeah, try look around, see if... <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Talk? Speak? Your heart rate is elevated, but you're doing well. Yeah. Thank, thanks, Dad. You should be proud of yourself. Okay. What happened to the other test subjects? Shh, shh, don't look at all that blood. Rob Zachney. If Rob Zachney was an alien species, 
and this is like a Star Trek situation, and Rob's trying to figure out when they should intervene in other other worlds. It would be this. You have too many standards. Not that you're going to self-annihilate, but here, have USB-C. It's fine. Make contact. Yeah, look at the writing. Look at the monitor. Rip those wires out. This doesn't happen. We didn't put this entity in quarantine. It expired at the crash. Ooh. The when you They're collective. Oh, right. Makes sense. They're not able to... We're sort of, like, emotionally translating the words. Uh-oh. What did you do? I removed the wires that were in, in, no, in, in no. their chest. Oh, so we're manipulating one of the other creatures. We're causing an alien we're escape. Doing... <laughs> yes! Yes! I need you to stop what you're doing, please. Oh, it's too late for that, Mulfrayer. Do we, though? The sister had photos of a forested road. Are we the same guy? Patrick, I think these stories are connected somehow, as you as you sort of intuited. Hmm. Get out through that window. Oh well, we probably want the device. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> it's using the tool we recovered from the crash site. It's in our systems. It's sending something across the network. It's broadcasting. Mr. H, please. We deeply regret what we have put you through, but please understand it was for the greater good. We had to know more. Rebelling now could be catastrophic. You don't know what this might do to you in the long run. <laughs> I assume it's just a match game? Yeah, I... No, it's not. It can't be. Arrow keys... Oh, wait, wait, wait. The symbols. Arrow the symbols. keys left, right. Change glyph. You know, captures are getting so complicated these days. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck me. This is hard. I, I think it's trying to give us the code. Oh, through that? Oh, I don't like this. Should I just look up the solution? <laughs> yeah, this is pretty rough to look at, dude. Okay, yeah, hold on. Look it up. The walkthrough king. Uh, all right. Which ones have you messed with? Only the bottom one, right? No, I messed with a bunch. Oh shit. Okay. Well, this walkthrough's not gonna help. Um, hold on. That one. Here we go. Uh, okay. So this, the top one, make it the figure eight, like like the number okay. eight. Uh, the second yep. one, so the thing's kind of jutting off to the left. Yep. That one. Uh, third one, uh, it's going to have a little rectangle at the bottom on its own. And then the last one is the figure eight. So I think that's it. Let's now try it. No, it didn't go. Oh, wait. Well, 
Yeah, we got it, right? Okay. Orb. Orb. Yes! Yes! Orb. 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 Let's start with three on 33, where we demonstrate the power of collective action. Uh, we bring our <laughs> orbs together. Orpolation. Yes, accept me yes, as one of you. Become part of it. I have nothing left for me at home. Let's unionize. <laughs> Grad students, rise up! One day, station. This will haunt you. You? What do you mean? They, haunt Patrick, me. They tell everyone that it's not true. You locked me up. I've always been saying we should free the orbs. That was very good as well. We gotta do the station process. Oh, keep going. Yeah, let's go. I got an hour before I have to pick up my kids. Oh, damn. Dr. Bucket pointing out this story just got untold. <laughs> <laughs> Happy family! Show me the orbs! They should be adding oh, things a... to this title sequence. Yeah, they should. Like, show, show me my happy orb family. It's Orban time. <laughs> oh my god. Station 3, do you read me? Oh hell yeah. We're in Greenland. Give me a sign, man. This storm is getting pretty wild. Come on, 3. Long I'm gonna, go grab, my, I'm gonna grab myself a around. snack. You, feel, you get started. Get a, get a feel for the room. Finally, what took you? Is the microphone still broken in station three? <laughs> Sorry guys, I wildly dissociated and I'm just um, traveling I'm through an, a horror anthology. Yeah, you can't reply. You should be able to hear you though. You can see activity registering, so your voice is definitely going through. Oh, okay. We can chat later, three. Yeah, this is pretty serious. I've had a distress call from Central. There's a situation and we have to fire up signal monitoring and relay systems right away. What kind of situation? I don't know. I'm assuming it's got something to do with this storm. Whatever it is, it's big to want to involve us. I've got a little Shit. bit silly. Okay, what do we do then? Well, my fucking cabin power isn't holding up in this weather, so I can't process the signals myself. Two, you need to feed the frequency information through to the backup terminal in station three. And three, you just need to tune, decode, and process. Just refer to the handbook on the microfilm. It'll walk you through it. I've never done any of this stuff, so I'm not going to be much help. Does everything seem cool here? It's simple. Yeah. Honestly. Well, it's Greenland, Patrick. It's, sleep. it's cold. Oh, I love Greenland. Okay. All right. First one is due to appear in a minute or so. Have a quick read of that microfilm handbook. It should be on your left. I'm going to get suited up and restart the generator. Don't fuck it up. Yeesh. Okay. Oh no, microfilm! Yes! <laughs> Ryan, it what is do you think good. Is, what's buried beneath the earth? Okay, three, we're up. Oh Two, no. Whatever it is you're supposed to do. Oh no. Ooh. 
Ooh. Oh no. How do I zoom in? Nope, didn't mean to do that <laughs> shit. <laughs> Alright, uh... Yeah, I can't, I, I can't read it through my fuzzy video call. It's, it's fuzzy here though, too. Um... Oh. None oh, of the buttons? Boy. What about that little... Oh, this is bullshit. Look, there are knobs oh, under this... the screen. Look, Rob, Rob, Rob. Yeah, what? What about those? These? Above those, like those. Do those do anything? No. Yes, I didn't see yeah. this one. Let's go. Sharpen that focus. There we go. Let's go back to the beginning. <laughs> hey, uh. I think people. Rob. It was not well enough understood Rob. at the time. Yeah, I know, I know. What are you doing? Spinning <laughs> out. It was fine before. You didn't have to touch it again. No, it's a little crooked. There we go. <laughs> there we go. All right. We at Central Monitoring Division would first like to thank you for agreeing to commit to a year's service at Remote Monitoring Station. Uh, the work you do is of importance, of vital importance to national security and blank of our great nation. While you may never receive the explicit gratitude of our citizens, we will always be indebted to you. Operator role. As an operator of our remote monitoring station, uh, uh, they're responsible for the following duties, daily monitoring, in event of national security emergency, you'll be asked to monitor, blah, blah. Carry out maintenance. Yeah. All right. What? Yeah. Austin's already hey, up Patty, now. This last yeah? one. In case of what redacted, your fourteenth and fifteenth molar teeth. Okay. Is that? Are we? Is that to? Rob. Is that to kill ourselves? Uh. I. Boy, I hoped it was for identifying your corpse. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Maybe it still is. Also, this is dated 1986 is. again. Look. It was a good year. Or Rob, how hard do you have to bite down on your teeth in order to have one of those released? Could you do it by accident? I would assume it's very hard. Uh, otherwise, yeah, you just have secret agents dropping dead all the time. Okay. Sys.exe-f-y? Is that a Y? Yeah. You? No, you. Alright, dash you, dash con equals true. Oh, shit. Uh -huh. We coded it. Hey, hold on. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Hold on. Where was the... Right, input broadcast authorization key. Hmm. I missed something. Yeah, I'm. I'm a little bit. Rob, are you sure it's not just a post-it note? No, that was our login for the computer. I guess we tried again. You already I typed this code once before, though. Oh. No, I didn't. Hold on here. And then do we have to do a frequency on the right-hand side?
Okay. Yeah, they maybe we're messing with oh, the man. thing over there on the right. Yeah, but... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, FM... Oh no. There we go. Okay. And now nailed it. Alright, hold on here. Um back to the manual here real quick. The, there's a map that was on display a moment ago. Alright, let's see. Nope. Can I see this other one? There's another note. It's killing me that I can't get at it. Okay, well, uh, I, as a hint, it's another set of numbers we need to put in. I do know yeah. that. I don't know where we get them from, though. Uh, I'm I mean, I can tell you, but that seems like that. Me. No, well, that can't be it. Press the power button. See what happens on the radio. Oh. 13, zero, 14, 14, there it is. Nine, three. Perfect. Fuck yeah! All right, so now we, now we do the abacus thing. Okay, gotcha. Abacus is page six. Let's go past it here. Did you pass it. There we go. Yep. There we go. Yep. Sys.exe dash d dash a. Allocate two o two dash a. No, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> okay. All right, but how do I? You just click. Okay. Oof. Arrow key. Was it tab? It's arrow arrow key. key. Okay. Output log. Output log. Minus false. Dash false. Yeah. Can I execute? This has one? some. Um, what is it in the in the mind of Matt? What's the what's the mountain of Craft One? Uh, Mountains of Madness. Mountains of Madness. Hold on. I feel like I feel like <laughs> Cthulhu is about to be unearthed. Oh, Rob! People are saying you can type while looking at the microfilm uh, reader. Oh, really? Something to know in the future. Okay, my light here just turned green and the signal stopped. So I think you did it right. Well, right is in the, the eye of the beholder. Or the orb of the beholder. Don't leave them hanging too long. I don't know what they're for. But I know we have to make them top priority or I'll get shit. Of course, don't worry, we'll keep on top of it. Okay, there it is. Creepy sounding things, aren't they? Hmm. Alright. Flip that on. And then we have to change the frequency, Wait. huh? 350... 3500, rather. It's 
Just a wee bit more. Just a wee bit more, Mr. Zachney. An upsetting voice. Chevron. Chevron. Chevron is very near the end. Twenty. Whiskey? No, that's later tonight. Wait, um, hey, can you go back a second? Was Jennifer one yeah. of them? Hmm. Oh, that can't, that, sure, fine. Was it? Yeah, Jennifer was the sister mentioned in the first story. Uh-oh. Also, someone also mentioned Sacrifice was one of them. <laughs> what, do we know what... Rob, do we not murder our family, but sacrifice them to a cosmic god? I hope not. <laughs> nope, that's not, uh, it is not letting me type. Oh yeah, it is, okay. Huh? It used to, right. oh, do you not hear the, the, the clacking? I don't hear it, yeah. Yeah, I see. Do you hear it? Are you just doing all these bad boys? Wow. Trying to. Rob is very, Rob is very confident in their typing. Well, I can check. All right. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, you have spaces in front of those W's and Z's. The W. Uh, that I'm supposed to have, but this oh, okay. I'm not supposed to. Uh, proc begin, was that the only command on that line? Alright. Yeah. Wait, what was the little thing they have there? Variable replacement, where x equals... Second, y equals fifth, and z equals sixth number from broadcast. Oh. Okay, hold on. Okay, so now second, we have to list it. We need second, fifth, and sixth. Okay. Do you have a pen on you? One, two. Hold on. I will open up my. I, yeah, I have it. Where is my notebook? Right here. I think I got it. You got it. One, two. Twenty six, fourteen zero one two. So it was two, five, and six, right? So six. Twenty. One, two. Careful. Yep. All right. What are the numbers again? Six one two. Okay. Oh yeah. Thanks, three. Just pushing this update to the transmitter now. Getting the hang of it, huh? Rob, right, what are Next we trying? <laughs> Where are these transmissions going? What does GCS mean? GCS. What do you mean? Yeah, now this next one has come through with an additional note. GCS3 equals E1 V1 M1. I've not seen it before. Check the microfilm. Might be something in there about it. Yeah, there was, that was a special case. Let me know when you're done with that one. I haven't heard back from the transport team and I'm starting to worry. Sure yeah, they're not coming for us, bro. Okay, here it is. GSC. Whoa. Okay, that's different. Flashing red screen. Yeah, quite the warning sign. Shit. Something's going on. The last two must have just been testing the system. Tune it as normal and I'll see what I can I don't can think this is in ours, I think it's in hers. Damn lights on. Mask, no, but hang on. portfolio, Sigma, Eagle. Note that any instructions carrying a GCS flag it must be dealt with as a matter of urgency. So that is okay, a... Okay, Rob, get, ba get is... the fuck back over there and turn on that... Oh, Appendix D. Yeah, hold on. Appendix D. Uh...
Oh boy. <laughs> cool. It's all, re all right, it's well, all get... blotted out. All right, we get well. We got to turn on that yep. frequency thing anyway. Yep. All right, crank that. This is like me trying to get oh, the, no. uh... It's Morse. What? It's Morse code. Oh my god. Can you do shit like this? No, I have a fucking horrible ear for Morse. Uh, okay, Wander Stibbins, there was a Morse reference on the microfilm. Why don't we go look at that? I'm sure there is. I need to know what characters I'm, I'm getting is the issue. All right, I'll just look it up. No, we can, hang on, let's give it a minute. Yeah, all right. First, let me spin this around. Obviously. <laughs> there we go. Hey, can you also, people are saying some of the stuff on the GCD page was not redacted. Can you go there so we yeah. can just read that? What are, what are our options? Uh, Can you read it? I can't really read it through the... Oh, here we go. Yeah. Opens to verbal command, speech, or shout. Uh, not, none. Obeys commands for movement. None. So it's... Oh, it's obeys commands command for movement. Hmm. What is this flow chart? Okay. Oh boy. Uh so was, is this the more stuff? No. Okay, these are the only ones we have to worry about. Alright, Rob, finally you can flip that shit. Oh, oh I understand now. Oh, is each one a different one? Yes. All right, so the first one is the bottom one. Uh, no, so it's, I, the first one is nine. And how do I how do I make this? There we go. Okay, so the first character is. Just do the numbers, and then we'll figure out the order. I think it opens with zero zero. Oh my god. Okay, lacking. Okay, I think, lacking I think it's zero zero seven. Okay, Rob, reader, the, the listeners have two two suggestions. Do we see which one is right? Yeah. Okay. Sure. 097740 and then 097730. Give me the first one. 097740. Alright, then try uh, just a three zero instead of four zero. So zero nine seven seven three zero. There we go. 
All right. Nice job. Oh, this is some gravy in the oh, chat. Oh, shit. This is new. All right. Turn that shit off. <laughs> the screen now says urgent. urgent. This, this is, is a live scenario. Live scenario. Okay. Kansas. Zoom out a little bit. All right, yeah, I guess you can just do this. There you go. <sighs> Variable replacement. We're x largest number from original broadcast. Y smallest number from original broadcast. So three and zero. Well, but it means original broadcast. Does that mean original for this I section or original from, or from the code we just unpacked? Yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna start entering the code. Uh, yeah. All right. What do we think then? The largest number from. When it says original yeah, well, broadcast, I have to think that means the like literal start of this. Um, no. Well, I didn't write that down. Hmm. I gotta believe also, it's. I, it was thirty. Well, we can try it from this broadcast, and then we'll, then we'll just then we'll. No, people are saying it's the Morse one. Okay, all right. So all right, go so back over the there. largest number in the Morse code. I don't know, you gotta... Oh, uh, nine? And then zero is the... Um... The lowest. I think you need a space between your X and Y's, but you can clean that up after. So, so uh, the Y number is zero? Yes. Or G? That's what that looks like, right? Or 46. You can, I think so. You could probably zoom in. Or G. Ooh. Uh, so you're just missing a space between EX and 9 um, up there. Let me tell you, this is not the easiest on a split keyboard. <laughs> it's all the characters and shit that, uh, like, I don't have an, I don't have arrow keys on this uh, in a in a place that makes sense. Because what uses arrow keys? Uh, let me just real quick here. Uh, cell dash a dash four G. Okay. Okay, one, we're done. Nothing has happened really. All good. What did you want? I'm about to head outside to look at this generator. My cabin hmm? is completely out. Listen, Scorched Earth? Patrick, check the roster, we targets? target? We from the supply team three days ago. But I've had nothing. Launch success. No Do we just... Shit. Yeah! I hope not. Three. Can you monitor a range for me? <laughs> Rob, what did we just do? Somewhere between eight, eight and a half thousand range. FM. See if you can track it down for me. That's our supplies for the next six months. If they turn back, what do we do? We can reschedule. I'm more worried that they didn't turn back. Otherwise, we'd be having a drink by now. The boat was called 20F. God, yeah. Okay. Three. Eight, eight and a half thousand FM somewhere. See if you can pick up a distress signal or something. Okay. Eight to eight, fifth, eight, five hundred. Do we just blow up Kansas, Rob? We <laughs> Ranch launched... B, how will, how will this affect Mahomes' legacy? <laughs> You 
keep going. I mean, was that voice the one we wanted? Nope. Are we getting civilian radio too? Does anyone read? Yep. This is Clivus 20F. Do you read me? Oh my god, that's them. This is a distress signal from Supply Vessel 20F. Please respond. Is anyone there? Can we respond? We don't have enough supplies to last whatever this is out. We have some on board, but it's not enough. We try to turn back, but the storm or them have messed with our GPS and sent us straight uh, to the What earth is he talking about? We're holed up here. We just got word from Central that New York has fallen. Excuse me? Us being so remote would give us time, maybe, but uh, I can see them coming. Be ready, all of you. XCOM! One, are you there? Are you hearing this? Lock your door, two. Three, do the same. What do you mean? Did you hear the report? Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure the door, New York is, New York is falling, but <laughs> this flimsy door is gonna help. Then it went dead. What are you Fucking talking rules. about? Just do it. They're here. Ah! Who are they? Aliens! Shit, one, there's another GCS signal coming in. Do we do we process it still? Yeah. As long as the GCS number is going up, we're helping a lot of people. It was three. We are oh, wow. Are we launching That's nukes? That's good. Just process the signals. That's it in. Rob, Rob, did you lock your door? I there's Can no there's no way to interact with the door here. It's just not oh, okay. All right, all right. I mean, we already know that uh, Asian uh, is is sort of of ambiguous loyalties here. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, he might be a fully on the uh, uh, Zulu Timor Sierra Hotel oh. Bravo Echo. ZSHPE. I got Bravo and Echo. Wait. Zulu. Alright, Mike Zulu's here. Hotel Bravo Echo. Hotel. Bravo. Echo. I got all of them but the first one. Uh, it was Mike. Mike. Okay, so Mike, Zulu, Sierra, Hotel, Bravo, Echo. So what does that... Uh-oh. Is it just in the GCS chart? There we go. There we go. That's... Yeah, that's Rob. Something. Flip it! Flip it! You love it! Alright, so All right. it is now... So Mike is first. Wait no, but we already know that. Oh, it's just this a is, It's just the yeah, first letter of each. Okay, What's so this translated M to? Z S H B E. So just go put that in. Or did, did, then does that translate into this other chart? Yeah. That's All right, go to the other chart. Yeah. So we're so I have I have the translate. Well, it's just the first letter, but yeah. Let's look at these other ones. This shit. Okay, hold on. No. Flip, 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 Adelphia. No, it seems. Okay, so on. M. Hold on. So, what is the frequency we're on? Right? Are there frequencies at the top? 
6970. Is that one of our options over there? Yes. yes. Okay, so M. All right, so scroll over to M. Yeah, let me just adjust this a little bit. There we go. Any bet? M. Okay, so 15. Give me that sharpen. Z. Yeah. 2. S. 21. H. 10. B. 4. E. 7. Okay. Alright. Alright. Hit that code again. 15. 2. 21. 10. Four, seven. Okay. Centaur. So that we yeah we just go over to the PDF. I'm sorry, microfilm. Uh, the the microfiche, yeah. <laughs> Home Jennifer Sacrifice is the order of those. Hmm. Fantastic. I'm ominous about that. All right. Uh, I'm that. All right. And... I see the callback code. Conversion operation was input the following command lines. The terminal is substituting any dynamic variables and execute. Uh, I think you just put this in cold. Yeah, this there's looks... no variables. W, right? Uh, yep. That looks right. Okay. Don't fuck it up. The world's at stake. Or you're about to destroy the world? I don't... I don't... Oh, flawless. Flawless execution. Three. There's something... I don't know what I'm looking at. Cabling? One, I can see something above Three's cabin. One of the power oh, three's down. down. Three, three says that was fucked up with his generator. One, he did go outside. I can't talk back. Oh! Fuck. This is just like in the quarry. Fuck. It's Santa. What the hell is that? <laughs> I can't see you from here. What's going on? It's above me. Shit, it's above me. It's over station three, two. They're here. What's here? Jesus, one, what the fuck is out there? It's fine. It's fine. You'll be fine. Cyanide time. Bullshit! Shit. Here's another signal. GCS7 equals E1, V5, M1. One, what the hell? It's flashing urgent. Better do it. I learned anything from the last one. We should just be compliant. Oh, USB. Rob, this is the origin story of USB-C! Aliens have come to free us from One, bad standards. Eight, nine, zero, four, five. One, eight, yeah, that's it. Nine, zero, four, five. Hit it! <laughs> Sacrifice! Oh, no! Eight, eight, Nine, Turn that shit off! Zero, four, Guys, are any of you walking around in that store? Who the fuck That's is NS4? You'll get yourself killed. No one is outside. You're seeing things, four. That was an American. Show me sacrifice. It's, uh, it is this what you said, wasn't it? Sacrifice. 
I think so, yes. Home, Jennifer, sacrifice. <laughs> All right, zoom in a little bit. Um. Takosake is pointing out the idea of an apocalypse three. happening with the radio. Oh. Number station three. This is station four. Do not go outside. Don't go out there. Stay inside. Lock up. Do not go out there. Um. The idea of an apocalypse happening with the radio is so good. Pontypool was so good. There wasn't a huge fan of how weird it got later. Yes. If you like the vibes of this specific story, go look up the horror film Pontypool. Came out a number of years ago, but is excellent. I right, see this call by code. Uh, Conversion operators must input the following command lines in the terminal, substituting guys, any dynamic variables. Five and get the fuck out of here. They took six. Station six is fucking gone. Those things just ripped it out of the ground. Well, that seems bad, but we yeah, should keep doing our jobs. Yeah. Um, X equals numbers one, two, and three from the original broadcast represent a longitude. Okay, so well, so one, two, three is one, eight, nine. All right. One, eight, nine. Y, numbers four, five, and six, zero, four, five. Here, let me type, type the command. All right, hit me with that number again. Uh, the first one or the second one? The uh, second number. Uh, zero, four, five. All right, and point. So we have to look this up. Oh, yep. Z, Appendix Z. Authorization word from Appendix C. So yeah, that's gotta be at the end. Okay, uh, we're on USB. We were on 8150. I don't know. Broadcast. Yeah, you're right. Hold on. So it's oh. Nine, eight, nine, nine eighteen, twenty, twenty-five. Five. The numbers are less than thirty. All right. One, eight, nine, zero, four, five. So it took a total mm. less than twenty. Uh, you said it was twenty-five. So it was yeah, hold on, let me double check. 9, 18, 24, it's 25, so less than 30, but also I guess greater technically than greater than 25, so. Don't, uh, so Dar Darwin, right? No? It didn't say, it didn't say equal to, but I guess we'll try it. Yeah. 8150. Total grade in 30? No. Uh, boom. Uh, I think it's... Al okay, we're looking at Alexander. Alexander. Okay. Carefully got the whole thing highlighted. Okay. Is that the only other command line here? Is there, is there, a, was there another command here? In this I, line? I think that's it. All right. Give it a go. Hmm. All launch. Okay. Well, look. Sometimes you just need a a, a bigger nuke. Send the house. The last signal hasn't sent. Uh -oh. My terminal is going crazy demanding a response. I think the wind has misaligned the transmitter or something. We need to go out to it. No. Uh -oh. Please, James. I'm sorry, but I can't get out. I'm trapped. You'll still be able to hear me, though. Go. Go. No! Oh! Uh. Are we being picked up? Are we we're being dragged? Oh. 
No, this doesn't. This doesn't seem right. This don't seem fucking right. What just happened? How do we get out of here? Well, just go and uh, fix everything, Rob. Ah, you're good. Don't worry about it. Just do your job. Everything will be fine. I want to make sure that 401k uh, yeah. keeps getting matched. Yeah, see, Mina also not, not psyched about what's going on. Cool stairs. That means we're going inside. Safety. Love. I think, we're just, I think we're just... Jennifer. Sacrifice. Oh, we're going all the way up here, huh? Rob, did you watch the first season of The Terror? Yeah. yeah uh, no, actually, that was I watched, shit, uh, like, part of it, and then, like, my like, box fucked up and I didn't get the rest. But it was also getting so ah. grim, I was like, I need to get back to that, but also... Oh, The Terror is so good. I never watched the second season. Well, I just heard it was different story, not nearly as good. Uh, yeah, I think that is the one that takes place in an internment camp. Um, yeah. It's the pivot to anthology move, right? Where it's like, the first yes. one was the novel. Yes. yes. And you get top tier Jared Harris in, uh, in that season. Alright, this seems fine. Just turn them all. Green. Uh, I can't seem to interact with them. All right, we'll keep walking. I can interact with the door. Oh, well, maybe we probably gotta come back. Maybe after some sort of alien bug has sucked our head out. Hmm. We in. Hmm. Oh, well, we're looking for a generator. Oh, the generator. You see, you see. Uh, yeah. Alright, my guess is you gotta follow the wire to the second one. You see that? Yeah. Which is the one that got fucked up? Also, Rob, are we living in shipping containers? Sort of seems like it. <laughs> All right, flip that juice on. Once again, not interactable, though. Um, right. There we go. Oh yeah, we got it. We've saved Earth. Time to save the world! Are we summoning the creature? Are we sure? Are we the baddies? I wanna go in. I think we did the job well done there. Yeah, let's go back. Let's go get some hot cocoa. Another guy was talking about having a drink. That means we got alcohol, probably this Uh-oh. I'm so tired. Excuse me? That seems weird. Like, why are, the, mm. why are cars like that even here? Hmm. I don't like it. James, please. Please, please. He's coming back. 
What? Yeah, people are pointing out that is very much the sound from War of the Worlds. Yeah, War of the Worlds. The movie fucking slaps. One of Spielberg's modern best action films. And that ship goes underneath human ship in the water. <laughs> yeah. That opening scene. Oh! Ripe for reappraisal. James, everyone is waiting on you. You need to wake up. Oh. These machines, they are your lifeline. Full of them. You hear murmuring? Please. Yeah. James. Oh, it's therapy time. Mr. Asian, can you hear me? Uh oh. Get back in your little cabin. Orb. orb it was orb. the thing. The house. Welcome back. Oh shit! But we have to go. We do. We have one more thing to do, though. Well, we are. We, we do are have one it. more thing. We do have one more thing. Kato, Ka are you? Are you there? I have to ping Kato. I'll ping Kato. Yo, yeah, it's Kato. 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 Someone. Well, we anyway, kind of uh, that was awesome. Yes, there. Um, this, this game rules. <laughs> God of New York has fallen. <laughs> yeah, Kato's yes, offline. These, these... No, Kato just responded. All right, there we go. Kato's jacking in. Yeah, these are great. Um, the, these are. I, I would kill for this to, to have been like an annual thing where there are just. Yeah different stories like this like a, like a season season bit um they didn't do that but there's something about the like the high res textures like the real like there is just the, the single space just fiddling with knobs um if you do like this i would recommend you check out or maybe we'll just play observation <laughs> i'll watch you play observation and i'll just experience yeah. it again um and and yes, I think this gives a lot of evidence for why they would be a really interesting developer to task with a a, a Silent Hill game. Um, so I have to imagine they would channel some of this energy. Um, well, and the fact that it's all like, and it all loops back to psychological horror and trauma. Uh, yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Yeah, oh, we we are definitely going to finish this. I think maybe what we'll end up doing is Rob and I will set up a stream. We'll finish this and start Observation. We'll just make that all part of the. The same, the same streams. Uh, Did Akato just appear? Now, now, oh god, I hear myself. Why do I hear myself? Okay, here we go. Oh, it's still happening. Oh well. Hi everyone. Well, it's it's that you're not going to be here. We're not going to be here for long, so you'll just deal with double. Yeah. Kato, you having double versions of yourself is thematically in line with what we just experienced on this stream. Oh, good, great. I love that. Um, well, New York has fallen, but Kato has not fallen. Um, Kato, we <laughs> oh, have. No. What happened to New York? Don't worry about it. Um, <laughs> uh, you just keep just keep putting in the the numbers. Um, much like Lost, actually. Oh. Uh, Kato, that worked out for everybody in that show. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we got a little announcement. Um, yes. Are you um, able to like put it up on screen? Can we show people? Yeah. In a second. <laughs> In a second. Uh, I am setting it live. <laughs> so if people want to run to run, don't walk, to waypointgeneralstore.com, there are now new awesome shirts and posters. Ooh. Um, I'm going to show the artwork. Hold on. I'm going to be... Should have downloaded this earlier. It's World here. premiere. World premiere. New merch. Uh, where is that? Merch premiere. Merch premiere. We got uh, Illustrator. 
Jimmy Gygrich, who does a lot of really great uh, metal style illustrations. Uh, I happen disclosure, I guess. I happen to go to school with, which is why I knew about his work. Uh, it is not an ethical breach to give people that we know in our lives money. Jobs. Yeah, I don't know. I'll just be safe. You're good. You're good. <laughs> um, give vice. <laughs> uh, disclosure. I bought Austin Walker dinner when he came over to, <laughs> to watch a movie with us. Uh, let me pop that into VMAX and then I can pull it up on screen. So we have shirts of this illustration. Waypoint. 666 Years of Carnage. Yeah! Look at that there shit! There we go. Yeah. Woo! Oh, it's so nightmarish. Funny. I love it. Um, and so, we can get that as a poster or a shirt? Yeah. You can wear it or put it on your wall. If I buy, if, uh, if I buy this, can I expense it? Is that How does that work for us? We, we, can, don't, we, don't, we don't get, get free samples. versions of our merch. We can merch. get samples. It's okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll samples. That's right. We need samples. to get samples. <laughs> samples. And I can get it the next time I'm out there. That so let me sense. double check that I actually hit the button correctly. I believe it should be live on Waypoint waypointgeneralstore.com. I say as I type this out. I guess I can check as well. It is there, but I am... it's at the bottom. Why is it at the bottom? I got to move that up. But it is there. It is fine. Yeah, we've got a t-shirt, oh, we got nice. a poster. Yeah, there it all we is. We got two sizes of posters uh, for you if you want. Oh, big 24 I want by 36 big, or big a, poster. 18 by 24. Give me that dummy thick poster. Yeah. Yeah, I'm taking the big poster. Uh, yeah, I actually need, I need a all the posters I have up here that are like related to things I've done are all giant bomb stuff. Pad. We've never done a poster. Um Mouse pad. We believe me, yeah, we want to do mouse pad. We also wanted to do the what's the what's the what do you call it? The big thing on the big desk. Thing? What's the yeah, big yeah, thing? It's not a desk mat, yeah. Yeah. Dust we want to do a desk mat. But I, unfortunately the Oh desk the mat. Store we, yeah. I heard dust mat. I was like, What? <laughs> yeah, dust mat. Yeah, no what yeah, when I'm cleaning I want a dust bin. Or when I'm cleaning cleaning my floor. Uh I want a little waypoint. Um so yeah, people can check that out now. Uh, there's the old merch is up there. Uh, new merch is there. Uh, kind of, could, would you be able to type text on the screen to point people towards where they can support the artists, like with, with other shit they got going on? They must have a website or an Instagram. Yeah, right? I mean it's uh, Jimmy Geigrich, which is a weird spelling. So let me. You're right, that's what I was thinking. Because <laughs> I will mess up spelling it all the time. Ooh, a blanket of this would be oh, very good too. Ooh, a blanket that would work really well because it's long. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, so their website is actually his website is is very easy actually. Gjillustration.com. Um, Gjillustration. Dot singular. Dot com. All all together, yeah. Gj it's for Jimmy Geigrich. It's just Gj Illustration. He snapped that one up. <laughs> Uh, Excellent. On the, on the screen in a second. Text. Boop, boop, boop. And it's appropriate because, like, this is like Waypoint's sixth anniversary. Uh, this is the time of year. It, it is. is. Waypoint is a product of the spooky season, and so we decided it was it was time for some slightly monstrous artwork. Uh, yeah. Especially, like, I mean, Kata, you had the idea. Uh, you and Rachel worked on this uh, a lot uh, to sort of develop this idea and uh, work with Jimmy on it. But yeah, I mean, you had the idea to lean in on the uh, like spooky 666 themes. thing and the spooky or themes, yeah, and and you, and you knew the artist, you had money. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, I mean, Kato, there appears to be some. There, there appears to be some dispute on. Hmm. It's very obvious who Ren and Rob are. There seems to be a dispute on the the goblins. You oh, and I. Oh, good. Am, um, <laughs> Are you on the, you're on the right. Yeah, I'm the little, uh, yeah, I'm the little, yeah, yeah. Well, Well, and also, like, it kind of looks like my hair a little bit. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Little, little, like, little wrinkly brain head is, like, curly hair. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Extremely good. So, um, so, excellent. Yeah, uh, please uh, feel free to check that out. Uh, Like we said, all the other merch is there. Uh. This is going to bring us to the end of stuff for this week. The podcast will be up soon, right? I kind of you're still finishing that probably, right? Yeah, yeah. soon. Um, so we're not working tomorrow. 
Yeah. No, we're we're not. Um, we're not working tomorrow. We're taking uh, one more day off as a, as a result of all the time we did doing Save Point and and all the time that y'all did tuning in, raising eighty thousand um, dollars. You just loved watching us play Saw, <laughs> and you know, I mean, who can who can blame you? Uh, don't worry, people we'll, went we'll get back wild to- for Saw. Yeah, we will get back to Saw at some point. I, I, we collectively came away from that going, we should probably see more. Well, I think, Rob, you concluded, though, I don't want to see all of Saw. I just want to see, like, an hour and a half well, more I, of Saw. <laughs> this thing, I strongly feel we are on a uh, The Thing trajectory with that, where it's like, uh-huh. hey, why didn't this get more pickup? In about, <laughs> in about one more hour, we will know exactly why it didn't get more pickup. Uh, but uh, right now I'm still in the hmm that could be something. Yeah, well, and according to how long to beat six hours, seven hour game. Um, so that is in the thing range of yeah, you know, about three mm-hmm. hours in, yeah. you're ready to you're ready to tap out. Um, but uh, yeah, so we'll be we'll be back uh, next week. Uh, Rob is taking a Monday off, but uh, we'll be recording. A hey, podcast. those Snickers bars won't be filled with fentanyl by themselves. Jesus Christ! Uh, I got a busy day busy day ahead of me. <laughs> Wow. Well, check for Rob on foxnews.com on uh, Monday <laughs> evening. Um, well, the uh, I can tell people here, the debut of Daddy's Day Off, uh, c- Cyberpunk 2077. I'm going to play that. We're going to the follow-up to Elden Ring. Uh, so uh, once a week going forward, I'm going to be playing Cyberpunk, uh, playing through that uh, with uh, y'all. So uh, please tune into that. We'll be starting that on Wednesday uh, morning, um, and then that, that the day that happens kind of bounces around based on the schedule of everything else uh, going on. So and maybe this will be an excuse to watch that anime because apparently the anime was sick. Um, anime is the reason a like, lot of people picked it the up. The anime recently. changed the trajectory of that game. Like, yeah, yeah it's it, dude. Somebody was ex- like, I was at the uh, like bodega down the street from me, and the guy at the counter was involuntarily hearing a lot about the anime from a guy who was just so hyped while he was buying his shit. He was buying, like, uh, Gatorade and shit, and was just like, I gotta tell you about this anime. And I don't think the clerk needed to hear about the anime, but he heard about it, and so did the people in line behind him. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so look forward to that. Um, and then uh, there'll be another stream on Friday um, that we'll, we're still nailing down the, the details on, but... Uh, yeah, stay tuned for all that. Thanks, everyone, for watching. We'll, we, and then, so I guess not next week, but maybe the week after that, Rob and I will get back together and we'll we'll finish Stories Untold. Um, the last story needs to be told. It's been it's untold at the moment. We finally will tell it, and then maybe we'll play some observation as well so Rob can also see that excellent game from the, the same studio. So, or maybe this is all uh, an XCOM prequel. Damn, mm. I hope so. Uh, uh, so, yeah, that's going to do it. Thanks, everyone, for watching. We will see you next week. Bye. We are out. Yeah, merch is great. No problem.